working in circular motions. T zone is very important. So T right here, zone, working all around the head here. Hey, it's Lance McGowan here. And today I wanted to share with you some essential oils that I use for my skin. And this is a part of my morning and evening routine. And the first thing that we're gonna start off with is washing our hands with On Guard Foaming Hand Wash. So I'm going to do that. So this cleans the hands all naturally, non-toxic. Just kind of work it all around. And that way we're starting everything on a good note. Boom, and then while the water is running, it's warm slash hot. And I'm just going to wash my face. Just kind of, just putting water on my face. So what this does, what this does is it you know, draws the blood to the surface of my skin. You can see my face turning a little bit more red, opens up my pores. And so I can better receive the carrier oil and essential oils I'm gonna apply. And then I just pat dry to make sure that, you know, just treating the skin with care and, you know, don't cause any extra irritation. Ooh, all right, so there we go. It's kind of refreshing. <laughs> the next thing actually I'm gonna do is open up everything. So I have the fractionated coconut oil. I'm just opening it up. The lavender, I'm opening it up. Peppermint. So this is kind of the prep process. I got Melaleuca <laughs> or tea tree oil and then lemon oil. So I'm gonna go over the benefits. So basically the doTERRA fractionated coconut oil is going to moisturize my skin. It's non-greasy, no smell. And also I put it all over my head. <laughs> So that way I'm moisturizing the whole head. Um, it's good if you have hair too. Obviously it moisturizes your hair and your follicles. Um, you see that I kind of worked in my ear, but not in the canal. So it's just kind of all around. And that way reduces irritation chance of the essential oils. And because I am working it almost like a face massage or head massage, I am drawing more blood to the surface of the skin so that the essential oils can go inside easier because the essential oils like to evaporate. And so this is really good to use and kind of nice little face or head massage. So I'm gonna use a drop of the lavender, which is very calming and soothing, helps with any redness or irritation. Peppermint is very um, cooling as well as promotes a healthy inflammatory response. And then you have Melaleuca tea tree oil. I have some water coming out of my nose <laughs> from when I was washing my face. Okay, anyways, we have Melaleuca or tea tree oil which takes care of the unfriendly microorganisms hiding in the pores. And then we have lemon oil, which exfoliates and supports your immune system. And you may be like, well, what do all those have to do with your skin health? Well, I'm rubbing it together, which is hand reflexology. There's face reflexology, rubbing it all around my face. It helps to do upward motions to go against gravity and help with your pores. And so I do a lot of against the grain type of you know, application. And there's also ear reflexology, which I'm putting it in my ears, not in the canal, but in and around the ears here, behind the ears, like here as well. So <laughs> I'm getting face reflexology, ear reflexology, hand reflexology, aromatherapy up in my nose. And so this is really invigorating, <laughs> by the way. So the way that this helps you is that the three main causes of acne are unfriendly microorganisms, excess oil, and dead skin and when they get caught in the pores it creates a really nice feeding frenzy for those unfriendly microorganisms and then those pimples start to form and you know white and red blood cells rush to try to take care of things and there's like a battle and so you don't want that happening and what you want to do is address everything proactively and this is part of my regimen are there other oils other different products that doTERRA has for skin that work yes uh, this is what I found to work for me and I did a lot of studying on this, did a lot of research and it's really helped me out a lot. And I do this morning and night and I make sure that I do this consistently. And when I don't, I start to see little things pop up or when there's people around me that are under the weather or if I start to get, you know, not feel so well myself, I start to know my body talks to me by putting these little, you know, pimples or breakouts on my face. So I know that I need to take care of my gut health and I know I need to take care of my skin because my skin talks to me and tells me what's going on in my body. And I did a video on reflexology, face reflexology. So you can see if you get something popping up, whether it be wrinkles, fine lines, dark spots, you know, zits, pimples, whatever it is, anywhere on your face, that means there's a body organ associated to that. And so you need to correct what's going on in that area. And you can do so with reflexology. You can do so with what you eat and, you know, your stressors or what's stressing you out and stuff like that. But otherwise, I'm going to put the cap on everything. So that way, you know, we're good. 
but yeah, I mean, I, I really enjoy washing my face. <laughs> it's been a great process and it's allowed me to save money. I spent about half as much as I do now on these because all these will last me about a couple months before I run out. And it's just, you know, one drop of each and just a pea size amount of this, or maybe a, a quarter size because I, I do my whole head. And that is really helpful to make sure that I'm supporting my wellness in a very natural, safe, and effective way, and a less expensive way as well, especially with the doTERRA Loyalty Rewards Program. So what I did to get well, I'm doing to stay well, and I constantly tweak to make sure my quality of life is being enhanced along the way. Well, that concludes today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to hit the like button if you did, hit subscribe for future video updates, and most importantly, check out some of the links in the description below so you can continue to get your learn on, and I'll see you in the next video.